Eagle Scouts dedicate their lives to live by the Scout Oath and the Scout Law. It's like they should have a club or something. Hey, Scout Stan. You know, this is not an ad for NISA. Okay? I'm a member. Okay? I believe that NISA is one of those organizations that adult leaders should be involved in. NISA, National Eagle Scout Association, is exclusive to Eagle Scouts. So that is requirement one. <laughs> you have to be an Eagle Scout. Uh, that's, that's the first off. But this is not an ad to go and get a membership, okay? So you should know about this uh, because even if you're not an Eagle, there are people running around with NISA stuff on their uniform. You need to know about the National Eagle Scout Association, NISA. You need to know about that. Um, that's, that's important. In 1925, the Knights of Dynamis was, was basically organized in San Francisco. Uh, this organization was built for Eagle Scouts so that Eagle Scouts could give service back to their community. In 1972, the Boy Scouts of America incorporated the Knights of Dumas into the National Eagle Scout Association, NISA. Now this as a side note, the National Eagle Scout Association of the Philippines keeps the eagle and the sword that was in the Knights of Dumas that has that logo kind of incorporated in their current day organization. Now, I know a lot of you are in the United States, but believe it or not, there are a lot of fans in the Philippines and throughout the Asian arena, okay? So, scouting is international. And a lot of the organizations we have here in the States, they also have elsewhere. So, that I found very fascinating in some of the research was this logo relationship that they had. It was just Amazing. Now, membership in the NISA, National Eagle Scout Association, there are two types of members. Membership, standard membership, which is usually five years. You get a five-year membership. Um, once that's been done, uh, you can expand that into the second level, which is known as a lifetime membership. Now, lifetime memberships are really expensive okay so if you're going to do that that's that believe me if you're young you want a lifetime if you're older <laughs> several of the uh several uh just regular memberships would be fine all that all of that membership stuff goes towards benefiting many of the things that nisa does now, I'm going to put some of the stuff down below, but you need to go to NISA's website to, to actually find out what the current membership fees are, okay? Now, membership fees that they go for, that a, lot of that, that a lot of that funding ends up being uh, college scholarships for Eagle Scouts to go to college. So, scholarships are a wonderful thing. Um, so those, those grants, that scholarship going to scouts um, based on their service projects. Now these are all Eagle Scouts. Everybody involved in NISA is an Eagle Scout. Uh, the Scouting Alumni Network that they have also is part of that. So if you're an alumnus of scouting, you're no longer with a unit, you're just an alumnus, there is an organization with scouts through NISA that you may want to be involved in, especially if you're a lifetime member. Uh, I myself am a lifetime member of the National Eagle Scout Association. I got it when I was very young, okay? So it was worth it. <laughs> that was the thing, you know? You want to get it when you're young, you get the lifetime membership because you got to live a long time, right? Um, the... Um, they have a lot of exclusive patches. Patches, uh, different things that they wear. An Eagle Scout 
that is a lifetime member has a silver border around their knot. Look for it. You'll find it. You'll see it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so definitely think about that. Okay. So there's a lot of exclusives there. Uh, Nisa, uh, they always have a special event at Jamborees. And they always have some kind of display or museum or something that they do at Jamborees and uh, NOAC, uh, National Eagle, uh, excuse me, the National Eagle Scout Association will have something at NOAC, which is the National Order of the Arrow Association. That's their, that's their uh, big meeting they have every so often. So, you know what? I'm going to put a link up there for the for about NOAC, okay? <laughs> so, if you want to know more about NOAC, no AC, that's that's right up there, okay? So, um, they also have seminars at Philmont. <laughs> that's what NISA does. They have these, these great little meetups that they do. Uh, membership and annual discounts at retailers, okay? <laughs> Believe it or not. Uh, that I've got an amazing story, so you got to stay to the end. Got an amazing story that happened to me. It, it's it's crazy. Uh, Eagle Scout uh, magazine. Okay, there's a little magazine that they actually send out, and they do a lot of. Uh, they're they're representative of the national committee, so they are very much integrated with national. Okay, so obviously, so it is a, it is a, it's worthwhile to look into. If you're an Eagle Scout and not a current member, please get into it. There are a lot of benefits. Uh, if you aren't an Eagle Scout, you wouldn't be eligible for it, but you could remind that Eagle Scout that they need to do it. Okay. Or if you're looking for a really nice gift for an Eagle Scout, a youth, a membership, even a temporary membership, would be something. So that's that. That would be fantastic. Okay. It would definitely be a way of networking and getting out there and doing some really good stuff. Now let me tell you about this really crazy thing that happened to me. I was meeting up with my uh, district executive at a Starbucks. And it was Starbucks. I, personally, I, I didn't have any cash in my pocket. So I reach in my pocket, get my wallet, and I pull my credit card out and I hand it to the lady. Well, the lady looks at it for a little bit and I'm thinking, uh-oh, what's wrong? <laughs> she's looking at this thing she says you're an eagle scout <laughs> i had two cards in the wallet the one card they were both the same color that was the thing they were both silver i pulled out my lifetime membership to nisa and showed it to her okay she looked at that and said are you a li are you really an eagle scout i go yes i'm sorry here's my real card she goes ah never mind never mind she bought me a coffee. So there are benefits, I thanked her a lot. And of course, uh, tip jar, the next time I was in, I didn't have any cash. The next time I was in, that tip jar got a little extra. So <laughs> she was so nice about it. And, uh, but people, they just, they, they don't expect it. It's just something they didn't think about. I, I did not do that on purpose. Uh, I didn't try to get either. <laughs> so <laughs> don't. Scott is trustworthy, right? <laughs> so it does happen. It does happen. And scouting is one of those wonderful things that we participate in, and especially as leaders. So keep doing the great work you do, and I will see you on the trail.